I'm finally freaking doing it, everybody. I said I wouldn't do it, but I'm doing it. It's time for Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. It's me, Cooper, and uh, yeah, I'm a guy that likes to play a lot of Digimon games. This is one of the Digimon games I didn't want to play until Digimon Survive had already released and I beat in that game. But Digimon Survive is not coming out, and I've come to the I've come to the idea that you know what, it's just not going to come out. So whatever, this this is all fine probably. Yeah, I don't, I don't actually know. I've, I've been in this game before and I've been in the sequel before, but uh, of the Digimon games, this goes on my lower tier list. Like, if I had to have a tier list of Digimon games, this one goes near the bottom. And if you want to know my reasoning for it, it's because side quests in this game are not fun, and side quests in this game make up 90% of the game. <laughs> but I do love all the Digimon they add in this game, and that's, that's a big up, because I love Digimon. And the story... Is a bunch of side quests, so I guess I can't give it any credit. No, bad. But you know what? I'm gonna give this game a chance again. We're gonna play it on the channel. We're gonna see if you guys enjoy it, and I'm gonna see if I can find a way to enjoy it because honestly, this game is probably just a little bit better than Digimon World Dusk, and Dusk is very tedious and annoying, and oh god, the story was all side quests as well, but we'll see. So basically, as you could see, we're in the digital world, and everyone's on their own servers talking to each other. They all got avatars. Yeah, they all look pretty cool. You got Aquino, you got Blue Box. I like Blue Box just sitting there in the corner. That's funny. Uh, we got I A I O B A. Okay, Ioba. Sure. We got Old Man Fanta, of course. Who don't you wanna wanna? All right. They can break through security, steal data, enter password protected forums with ease. That's cool. Got some hackers, huh? Dude, that sounds awesome. They're behind most incidents that have been happening. Yeah, Digimon do sound nuts. No way. So basically, Digimon are hacking tools. Interesting. Yeah, Digimon can move. Digimon like digital monsters? Exactly. When did this happen? Mr. Navit has logged in. Mr. Navit? That's one hell of a login. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's one hell of a login thing. What, what, what's, what's up, Mr. Navit? What, what do you want to talk about? Okay. Yeah, Mr. Navit, huh? You mean that Eden mascot? What the heck? Why, yeah, why is an official here? Ah, uh, someone's calling him a hacker. Oh. Okay, what's the, be sure to log in to Eden tomorrow. Okay. If you don't log in, I'll hack you. Whoa, 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 that's a threat. I'm calling the cyber police. Eh, the cyber police aren't going to do anything. Okay, Mr. Navid logged out. That's all they said is that there's something going on tomorrow? Yeah, let's check it out. Why not? No, no one else wants to check it out? Uh, I'll check it out. Dark Knight Satan? Is that really that character's name? That would be a character's name. Hell, I had a friend that used to call himself Mr. Reaper, so... I guess I can't say anything. Dark Knight Satan actually fits the bill. I used to call myself Mr. Crash, so I mean, that's... Oh, crap, but it's for Crash Bandicoot, so I mean, that makes sense. Alright, anyone else want to come with us? Oh, yeah, get the hell out. Pass, pass. Love Crusher! No, Lee, come back, Love Crusher! Yeah! I'm in! If you guys haven't realized, that's our character right there. We're the little ghosty with the weird eyes. Yes. Okay, so Aquino Blue Box went on their late night gab fest. Yada, yada, yada. They spent much time doing stuff, blah, 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 and basically an appointment to see the hacker has come. Uh, for this game... With any Japanese game, I always try to play as the female, because for some reason, this is the weirdest thing ever, if you play as a female, the game is a lot less creepy, because Japanese games have a, 
I don't know. They're always creepy for some reason. Even the and yes, even the freaking uh, even the freaking Digimon games. I already had a creepy game on my channel, which was Digimon World Next Order, which you guys might not think is creepy, and I understand why, because most of the game it isn't, except for like two scenes. But I picked the female in that game, and those two scenes aren't nearly as creepy thanks to that. So hopefully, picking the female in this game will make any creepy scenes in this game less creepy. Oh boy, we're getting digi -tra that sound that, that would look so weird. Like if we actually had feeling in the digital world and you just get sucked into a portal, that sounds awful. Like what about getting sucked into a dark hole? Doesn't that just sound awful? Okay, so this is Eden, everybody. Basically, everyone uses Eden for everything. Shopping, business transactions, political administrations. Uh, it is literally just internet heaven. Uh, not, well, not heaven, but internet society. It is basically internet society. People can come here to walk and talk, do business meetings, talk, chat with friends. Just imagine if you could actually walk in your own little internet space. That is basically Eden. And it's virtual reality, of course. Look, this isn't my first time in Eden. You don't need to give me the introduction. I mean, everyone watching it might be their first time, but screw that. So, Kamishiru Enterprise basically was running Eden, and they're the ones giving it updates and stuff. That's our character. Honestly, a very cool looking character. I like the red hair with the yellow outfit. That's a good mix. I think, uh, if anything. And if you pick the male character, it's the exact same thing red hair, yellow outfit. So, it's actually pretty. Pretty well made. So let's see. Okay, I can already see a creeper right there. Let's go say hi to them. So what do we do? The entrance to Eden is where we are. I'm here. Okay, we're a little early, so I guess uh, what we can do now is uh, look around and talk to people. Since we're early. And see, so you got businesswoman, businessman, young man, businessman, little girl, dad looking character, creepy guy in the corner over there. Yeah, I don't know what their avatars look like though, but I, I'll be able to figure it out. Okay, time to make small talk with all the other avatars. Because apparently these people literally just sit here and do nothing. Alright, are you just giving me tips? I heard that Eden is filled with hackers. Yeah, why would they allow hackers in this in place? Creepy hacker! Wait, we could just tell that that's a hacker? What the heck? Alright, what about you? I got a cell phone digivice for my birthday. Your, wait, yours are those goggles? They're pretty sweet. Next time I'll pick some up. A go I'm wearing goggles? Okay, look there. No, wait. No, don't be so obvious. It's a hacker. You shouldn't get too close. Oh yeah, that's a hacker over there, huh? Digivice log into Eden and the voice features are handy. Still, maybe my daughter's too young for one. I'm worried about security. Honestly, you should be. God, should you be? You should be worried and you should be monitoring everything. All right, pavilions are a place where companies can uh, can safely and securely do business over Eden. Unfortunately, they aren't open to the public. Interesting. For any errands at the bank or post office, the forms can be taken here in Eden. That sounds boring as hell. I don't care about the bank or post office unless they're actual parts of this game. Okay, you can use access points. That helps out. Heard a rumor there's a ghost going around Eden. Uh, if you ask around, you'll feel serious about the white boy. <laughs> oh, that's going to be topical. <laughs> All right, so there's some creepy Doom guy, and he's called the White Boy. Got it. Nowadays, being able to work at company's Eden branch is a huge status symbol. Honestly, I would th I would think so. If everyone is using this place, then and you're a part of the company that uses this, then you're freaking amazing. Even though I'm in the digital world, my avatar looks like the real me. I know it's supposed to cut down on crime, but it still sucks. So basically, your avatars in the in this world are supposed to look like the real you, so that if you do anything wrong, they can find you. Very interesting. Did not expect. Why can't I pick that? Okay, I could. It was just a metal. Looking for your friend? If they're not here, did you try looking in the community area? It's an opening just like the entrance. Okay, interesting. So that was the correct person we were supposed to talk to. Huh, they don't see any avatars like them. I guess I showed up too early after all. At least we got that medal. Where are people about to come out of there? There's still some time left before the meeting. I should check out the other areas. Oh, okay, that's what we're gonna do. So let's go check out the other areas. Uh, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, I would like to go to an area. Yeah, you freaking fly. I love that. If there was virtual reality and that's how that's how you should be teleported is by flying. Not by being sucked into a black hole. That sounds terrifying. I would rather fly. That, that sounds really cool. All right. So this is the other area in this game. This is weird. Oh, look, there's a little item right there. They made it super obvious. So we gotta look at all these people and look for main characters. That's what I'm trying to say. Cause uh, if you see someone that looks like they're they're not an original model, then they're not a main character. Oh, okay, who could it be? Huh? 
Hey, it's Mr. Navit. Just one sec, you're behind schedule, silly. You're gonna be late. Hurry and come back, come to Cal Kowloon. Wait, did I go the wrong place? Bye bye So basically, Mr. Navit is gonna give us presents. And it's a dangerous area full of hackers. Uh, no need to panic. We're fine. Everything's gonna be fine. Yeah, what's this gift you want to give us in Galactic Park? That sounds like a cool name for something. I've never been anywhere near... How do I get there? Ah, oh, we're gonna need to ask people how to get there. Alright, well, let's go ask around. And guys, get used to that. That's one of the reasons why I don't like this game. Because it is a detective game, which I do usually like detective games. Get ready to walk and talk to people all the time. Now, this isn't a detective game where you're actually going to have to solve puzzles. They show you uh, puzzles. This is what you do. Do you have the answer I'm looking for? The answer is no. Okay. So, it's not you. But at least they give you the little lock symbol. What about over here? Oh, look. An item. Up on a mana. Okay. So, basically, no one here has the information we need. So, we got to go to another area. And that other area is obviously the Eden entrance. And then look at that creepy hacker. Oh, look, suddenly he has something above his head. Hey, I'm looking for this. I want to go to Galactic Park in Kowloon. That's what you think, huh? I'll show you the way. This is the URL. Okay, boom, we already got the URL that we needed. And that is how far detectiveness goes in this game, guys. There are going to be symbols of other people's heads, and you just click on all of them until you find the right one. That, that is, that's like the most boring game design I've ever heard in my entire life. And that is exactly what we're going to be doing. But, Digimon are involved, so it makes it okay. <laughs> oh, I'm going to be talking so much crap on this game. I'm, I'm going to get a lot of hate. I'm sorry. My hate is going to create hate against me, and I 100% deserve it. So go for it. Because there are good parts to this game. And when we get to those good parts, I'm going to be praising this game. So first things first. Cutscenes. This is a praise. I like cutscenes. Real cutscenes like this. So this gets a praise for being cool looking. And look at all these environments. Yay! I'm Superman! Hello, random person. You look like main character. See, look how happy my character is. This has to be, like, the coolest thing ever. Hey! Other main character-looking character. Oh. Oh, yeah, this game's in Japanese, by the way. I hope you guys don't mind. And maybe you could put it in English, but I, I didn't go to settings or anything. So, who cares? Alright, what's up? Sorry I'm late. I'm Cooper. I go by Ayaba. Would you happen to be Aquino by any chance? Uh, I'll, I'll just introduce myself first. Oh, I'm Aquino. This is your first time in Eden, right? Yep, my real name is Nokia. Nokia? Really? Shir Shiramine. Okay, nice to meet you, Nokia. At least that's an easy name to remember. What? What do you mean not? What's wrong? I, was, I didn't know that we were supposed to meet here. I thought we were meeting at the meeting area. I don't know. Why are you yelling at me? This is your fault. You can't you you came without me coming. Yeah, where's Blue Box? Wait, he showed up, then where is he? So Blue Box went to look for the ghost of the white boy, apparently. Okay, so you think he looks good. Good to know. Good to know. I'll be the judge of that when we see him. Okay, go, yeah, yeah, the pill boy, I mean, a ghost in cyberspace, that makes no sense. That makes no sense in the real world. Oh, look, there he is. Look, he's wearing a onesie, so that automatically gives him, like, minus points. I think onesies are not, what a onesie, that jumpsuit looking thing. They don't, they don't look too good. His hair, meh, no. Nah. I don't think he looks good, I think she's a liar. I mean, he looks fine. I'm not saying he looks bad, I'm just saying he doesn't look good. He looks like a wannabe Kaiba. Like, look at that outfit that wants to be Kaiba. But Kaiba looks way cooler and wears actual pants. Yeah, we've never met. My name's, uh, okay, what's up, Arata? Uh, so you're Sonata. Arata Sonata. I like that that rhymes. Uh, you two must have put two and two together by now. This is the, yeah, I know Blue Box. I got that. He's a big brother figure in the chat. I would not know that. Yeah, yeah, I agree. So you think he looks good? That's weird. I honestly don't think he looks that good. I guess everyone has their own tastes. Yeah, where is this Mr. Navit? 
So you were looking for a ghost, but the real reason we're all here is to look for Mr. Navit. Also, why did we even go come to this URL knowing it's super dangerous? All good boys and girls. But wait, wait a minute. All good boys and girls. Where have I heard this before? Okay, what's the miraculous power to change the world? I'm curious. What am I actually going to receive? We've been hacked? Uh-oh. A new program has been added. Digimon Capture. What? Digimon Capture? Yeah, Digimon, Digimon, what's up with that? Okay. So basically, we just got a tool that lets us scan things called Digimon, and then we can capture them. Yeah, you don't need to say it so slowly. We understand. Yeah, we get it. We get it. Yeah, Digimon are nasty programs that hackers use, huh? And I guess we just became hackers. So, what do you think? You just said- you. why did you want to come here in the first place where a hacker told you to go? If you didn't think that you were going to end up becoming something- a hacker or a hacker's, like, tool. And obviously you can't uninstall it. Why are you freaking- everything's okay, calm down. We're going to be fine. We're literally going to be fine. Who, who are you? Oh, what the hell? Uh, could that be the ghost everyone's talking about? Yeah, let's not get let, let the ghost get away. Let's go. Okay, go home. You're fine. If you want to feel, uh, trust me. If this is not a, oh god, I was gonna say if this is not your kind of environment, then get the hell out of it. That's true. You should. If you feel uncomfortable, you need to get out of that scenario. Problem is, they're forcing you in this scenario. So now we got a real problem. We're gonna have to find a way to break a firewall. Arata could be in trouble. Let's go after him. We might find an exit there, too. Let's go look. Yeah, you might not care about Arata, so let me go with this one. Oh, you're going to be one of those complaining characters. Oh, boy. Also, you have, like, six necklaces on. That's impressive. I don't. I can't even wear one because I feel like they're uncomfortable. I guess once you get rid of uh, used to one necklace, you can wear, like, six. All right, we could save the game through there. I definitely will do that eventually. First things first, though. Let's go over here. Alright, where the hell am I? Hell, this feels totally different from cyberspace. And there's no... Sir, uh, we can't find a rotter or anybody. Yeah, we gotta be careful. If we're in this dangerous area, and we don't know where anything is, everything's new to us, we gotta be very careful. So, the right way is obviously up, so let's go up. Oh, wait, what did we see? <gasps> is that the ghost? Ghosts are real? Cyber- You know what? I would believe cyber ghosts over real ghosts. I think you could create a cyber ghost way, way more easily than you could create a real ghost. Okay, I just had to take a knee there. The cutscene was coming in my head. Oh, crap. That's a real ghost. Oh. Okay, that's not as scary. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, hello there. Uh, okay, well, don't touch me. Oh, wait, if it's a ghost, can it... Okay, something has been inscribed. That's creepy. What What was that? Yeah, what, what was that? Yeah, who knows what might happen. Let's get Arata and let's get the hell out of here. Oh, is that the ghost? What the hell? Looks like the ghost. Hello, ghost. My name's Cooper. I know, weird name for a girl, but get over it. Alright, Ghastly Boy. Um... Yeah, I saw a ghost that looked just like you. The Wrath of Eden, good to know. Okay, Ghastly Boy, can I at least know your name? Because Ghastly Boy is a weird thing to call you. So you're not a ghost. You sound like a ghost. But if you're here to guide me, then uh, I, I really could use some help. Yeah, how did you know that? Well, yeah, I don't know how to hack. 
Okay. Find and report security holes in thieves who steal accounts to rob money and data. Uh, and those just to prove their skills. Okay, that's kind of cool. I think if I had to do anything with my hacking skills, it would be to get me free movies. <laughs> so I can watch some cool stuff. Uh, Alright, well, I don't actually care about becoming a hacker. I, I mostly just want to play Digimon. Can I play Digimon in this G Digimon game, please? It's been, like, a long time. It's been a super long time, and I haven't seen a single Digimon. Do you understand that? Like, that that's a, that's a bad sign in your Digimon game when I've been playing your Digimon game for a long time, and I haven't seen a single Digimon! There it is! Never mind, I'm happy. I'm back to being happy. Look at all these super cool starter Digimon. All different in their own way. I can only take one. I really like a lot. The excessively adorable animal type, the possibly fragrant plant type, or the mechanical looking machine type. We're gonna go with the mechanical looking machine type. A virus Digimon with electric attribute. Haguramon. Come on in. In fact, I only, one of the reasons I'm picking Haguramon is because I've already used Terriermon and Palmon in other Digimon games. So come on, Haguramon, I never use you. Get in here. So I finally have a Digimon, thank god. And I know you're trying to give me a bunch of tips about scanning and stuff, but guess what? I just want to play the video game. I don't want to look at all this. Yeah, I thank you for all the tips. And uh, you know what? Thank you for my first free Digimon. Okay, good. So basically, hackers in this world don't really hack, they just have Digimon. And if you win a Digimon battle, you technically get whatever you want. And security programs are Digimon. So security is also just Digimon. That is interesting. That is an interesting concept. Okay, thank you for the scan data. Uh-oh. Ooh, champion level Digimon. Kuri Kurisarimon or something? It's, it has a long name. Oh no, my Haguramon, and the other two that I could care less about. Help me! My Digimon are in danger! The Digimon I prepared you went. Oh no. Yeah, it could have been an attack. It's not about- I don't want that powerful Digimon. I, I wouldn't mind a Kurisarimon or whatever. Kurariasamon? I don't- I can't remember its name. But, uh, I would prefer to get my Digimon Hoguramon back, please. Uh, I have to go help. That's my Digimon and I'm not abandoning it. I'm sorry if you abandon your Digimon, but I'm, I'm gonna go get my Digimon. So, yeah. Let's go. Very quickly. Hey! Leave Kur- Yeah, you leave a Guramon alone. I will smack you. You're just program. You think I can't punch you? Granted, you have a bunch of spikes on your body. Yeah, I'll fight a digital monsters with my bare hands. Oh, hello. You have the power to teleport, huh? Okay, thank you for aiding me. So basically, this is going to be the first Digimon battle, but all we do is watch in. Lord, this he has a machine dream on! That's- oh, now Hagurumon's not scared. Dude, he has a freaking Machine Dreamon. That's so cool. That's like one of my favorite Digimon ever, and he has one, just to start. Okay, I will instruct my Hagurumon very well. I love Hagurumon's eyes. They look so cool. Alright, let's do this. Kurisarimon versus us. This is what the digital game looks like. Whenever we find a Digimon, we get to scan them. We have 50% scan now. Apparently we get to go first, and then Machine Dramon gets to attack, and then we get to go again. I'm just going to use a skill. Let me see what we have. Cog Crusher! Go! Yeah! Alright. Mock Rush 2! Alright, he's barely alive. I'll finish this. Basic attack! Yeah! Finished him off! Good job, Hagurumon. You're very shiny. The Digimon look beautiful in this game. Ah, we learned a new move. Nice. Aw, oh, you did amazing, little buddy. We're gonna be the strongest team ever. Uh, okay, ignore the big machine drum on behind us. Uh, behind us. Obviously, we're not gonna be stronger than that for a while. Okay. 
Yeah, this program likes me. Because they have feelings. Okay, thank you. And thank you for letting me see such a cool machine, Jeremon. Can I get one of those? Can I have one? Yeah. Okay, so apparently he's headed all the way... Well, I can't... Oh, behind there. I was going to say, I can't break a firewall. So this used to be old Eden, and then they got rid of it, so hackers took it over? Interesting. And called it Kowloon. Have him waned? Okay. Yeah, of course he hasn't told me anything. I barely... I, I just chat with him in a room for, like, no reason. Okay, I'm gonna ask uh, them directly. Yeah, who are you? Hey, you go? Okay, Team Zaxxon. Oh, thank you. So apparently this is... Okay, so are you, like, Team Rocket? But since, like, you're, you're the good guy, so I guess not Team Rocket? Nah, screw it. You're, you have a machine, Jermon. You're probably not the good guy. I'm gonna call you Team Rocket. So that's Team Zaxxon's leader, and they said that, uh, or he said that uh, we're always allowed there. That's very nice of them. So we got a cool uh, Hagurumon now, and they actually follow you in this game. Take notes, Pokemon. This is freaking awesome. Uh, obviously, we can't get past that firewall, so we're just gonna go the wrong way completely and not look at our map like we're supposed to. And let's just go back over here. You know what? I think we can go backwards first. The only reason I'm going backwards first is because I believe I forgot an item. Wow! I did not know this would happen. You okay? Where did those two go? Don't worry, there's no hackers around. What's going on? Oh, whoa! Agumon and Gabumon? What the heck? Two of the most famous Digimon? Oh, that's cute. That's cute. God damn it, Digimon are so freaking cute. Now that there's Digimon in this game, I'm happy again. Oh, Nokia, what happened? I'm coming, Nokia. Don't you worry. They're just they're circling you. That's what they do to their prey. Okay, I'm glad you agree that they're adorable. Are you telling me that she gets to have the main character di Digimon and I'm, I, I get Hagurumon? No offense to Hagurumon, but everybody wants Agumon and Gabumon. Yeah, why are they weird? Yeah, Nokia is a weird name. What? Atorb's good looks stunned you speechless? Uh, those are Digimon. What do you mean something familiar? Oh, that's nice. Now, those are those are Digibonds. So what do you what the, what what do you mean pheromones? Those are freaking Digibon. That's like saying that to your dog, but your dog can talk. That's like saying that to a talk. That's like saying that to Scooby Doo. Don't say that to Scooby Doo. Ah, I want to go get my own Digimon. Hey, I'm not scared! I swear I'm a good person! Aw, Agumon, Gabumon, come back, I love you! I had you both in the Digimon World Next Order Let's Play for like 10 seconds. Then you died. <laughs> hey, yeah, this is my Hagurumon. Looks super cute, right? Yeah, those are Digimon. Yeah, they don't seem like bad programs. They seem like nice little, little Digimons. Yeah, exactly. Go get yourself some Digimon. But no Agumon and Gabumon. That's too OP. Oh, it was. Definitely was. Yeah, I gotta go find Arata. That's, uh, that's our main plan. But the reason I came back here is because there should be an item back here that I never got. Oh, finally some Digimon battles. Koromons! Yeah! Koromons evolve into Agumon, so that's pretty cool. Um, she doesn't have a Digimon, so I'm gonna have to fight them both myself. Which is kind of annoying. For those of you curious, if you look at my character, uh, my little Hagurumon, right next to his name it has a symbol. That spiky symbol is the virus symbol because I'm a virus Digimon. These enemies have the neutral symbol, which is just a little minus sign. So because they have the minus sign neutral symbol, then uh, they're no threats to me. 
Uh, the neutral symbol just means that they're not weak to anything and they're not strong against anything. If you have a sign that's weak or strong to something, then you do more damage. You also can tell that they have the re uh, a red a neutral symbol. That's because they're fire type, I believe. My attribute is electricity, which is why our our character is yellow. So, yeah. Or our, our symbol is yellow and virus. It's, sim it's simple to understand. In time, you'll understand, because I it took me a little bit, too. So we found some HP capsules. Definitely going to need those. What else are we going to find? Poyomon and Gob uh, Pabumon. Yeah. All right, let's just punch Pabumon in the face. It looks like a baby, and I think that's adorable, but it's still going to get punched in the face. All right, Pabumon, thanks. Yep, thank you for hitting me. Just finish off one of them. Honestly, I should just be using Cock Crusher, so the fact that I'm not using it is only hurting us. Yeah, let me uh, let me show you guys how strong Cog Crusher... Oh, I have also this move. Let's see, this does 70 dark damage. This does 65 electric damage. I'd rather do dark damage. Cog Crusher! Yeah, there we go. Yeah, just start using your special moves all the time. Once you level up, you get all your all your health and MP back. Let's go to the next area. Wow, we were one step away. And look, another treasure chest. Nice. So this is Kowloon level 1. Oh, there's two treasure chests. I just looked at my map. Escape Gate. Those are really good. Uh, another Pabumon and Poyamon, that's cute. I'm gonna go ahead and, no, do what I said I was gonna do last time. I'm going to go for Cog Crusher, and I'm gonna kill the Poyamon first this time. Cog Crusher! It's 100% accurate, so I have nothing to worry about. Pabumon's just gonna basic attack me. Hagurumon's are pretty tanky, so I'm glad I picked Hagurumon. They're not gonna find any trouble here. Cog Crusher, it looks so cool. Like, it's Dark Cog. That's basically what I'm doing. Alright, we're getting a little bit of experience. Not too strong, but not too weak. Let's go ahead and get this and more HP capsules. Very good. Come on, Nokia and Hogurumon. One good thing about this game being a PlayStation 4 game and in the future is that we have actual characters following us rather than just assuming they're here. And we can see our Digimon, which is pretty cool. Alright, Mr. Arata, I'm here to help. <laughs> You went to the digital world as a kid? That... Really? That's weird. Maybe. Something is strange. What's strange is that we both have red hair. Like, that... I, I assume that would not be a common thing. Oh, that was weird. Yeah, I thought I saw, like, a ghost of five children. It's a messed up place, of course. Yeah, let's go. Let's go talk to Arata. How about that? That'll make you feel a little bit safer. I swear to God, if a ghost. Yep, yep. Look at that. That's impossible. You can't walk in that space. Only a ghost could do that. That's that's the that's a place no hacker could go. Huh? Big open area, and that looks like a logout zone. So perfect. We can get out of here. Oh, God, you saw it, too. Yeah, something doesn't feel right about all this. Yeah, we can escape. Can we please escape? Uh-oh. Ooh, it looks like an eye. What the hell? Ooh, no. No, Japan, we're not going there. No. Create something else. Okay, well, no, never mind. Looks just like a Digimon. I don't know why. The second I saw a tentacle coming out, I was just like, nope, we're done. No more no more playing. No more cyber sleuthing. <laughs> I don't want to know the answer to this mystery. Is that another Digimon? The Black Monster of Eden. Okay, so this is the Black Monster of Eden that, scan that absorbs data. All right, log we got to log out super quickly. Run. Hurry. Hurry. We need to leave. Run. Get over here. Oh, yep. She's dead. Yep. That's a death. This is what you get for having deer in the headlights. Hello there, Gabumon and Agumon. Man, Digimon are cool. There's like no reason, but they're willing to help. Oh, whoa, we're actually fighting. Okay, so I got your back. 
Hagurumon, Gabumon, and Agumon all working together. Their data is converging. Attack up. I just realized... Oh, but intelligence down. I just realized that I'm coming into this fight with not full health, so this is bad. I just realized my friends can do zero damage, so this is bad. Cog Crusher, our strongest move. Ugh. Oh, Jesus. Um, we need to run. Thank you for buffing my attack stat, but we need to run. A road terminal. A Gurumon! No! I took 200 damage. I'm barely alive after that. Oh, no. Hagurumon. Thank you for being so nice, Digimon. I'm sorry we can't help you. All right. Can we leave yet? Yeah, hurry up. And... Yeah, obviously they can get away if we can get away. So let's go. Yes, good. Run. Nokia is out. We did it. <laughs> okay, I know. I'm coming. I'm coming. We're getting out of here, everybody. Weird tentacle monster, go to hell. Oh, I'm tripping. Ah, oh, no. It got me. Someone come back and help, please. <laughs> Find us. But I just died. Warning. An expected error occurred during the logout for process for Coober Ayaba. The logout process cannot continue. Okay. So it fixed itself eventually. That's the good news. All right. See you next time. So apparently we made it to the thing, but while we were being grabbed at the same time. So eventually it had to let go. Eventually it let go and we were able to log out. That's the good news. Okay. We have become ghost. I'm going ghost!